the next time you hear the rumbling of a motorcycle gang approaching, take a good look at them. They may be the new breed of adventurers showing every generation how you reinvent the future. And ABC's Nick Watt hitched a ride with the growing tide of boomers revving up their three wheels. Beards, chrome, leather vests, more beards, and that noise. But these fellas aren't bikers, they're trikers, saddling up on an easier rider. Life without your bike is just life, and that's never been enough for us. But when old bones just can't handle two wheels anymore? I wanted to get a Harley, but I have a bad leg. Different reasons, different hip replacements, different back bend injuries, we go to a trike. As the baby boomer bikers of the 70s are aging, trike sales are through the roof, up 45% last year. Harley Davidson is even making a three-wheeled model, and many of these beasts, well, they're custom made. Most of us just want to keep ourselves in the wind. The brothers of the third wheel, a benevolent global triker gang, has 7,000 members and counting. There are guys still riding well into their 90s. It's a more laid back experience than a bike and riding pillion. I could have fallen asleep if it wasn't for Bobby's pink ponytail flapping in my face. Triking's keeping the aging and the injured on the open road. If you don't know the feeling, you know, it's hard to explain. Bugs in your teeth and, you know, it's just a blast. Are you going to ride this thing till you die? I'll ride till I either get killed or die. Born to be wild, Dawn is refusing to grow old and mild. Nick Watt, ABC News, on the Pacific Coast Highway.